Kobe Baker, finalist last year at the NCAA at Vermont University. He comes to camp this year, and he's really turned and impressed a lot of people without a doubt. And, you know, in this hockey game tonight, he scores the go-ahead goal on the power play, and he had a couple of goals last night in Detroit, just redirects the one past Jimmy Howard right there. But it's all about positioning. He's a big man. He skates very well. And the thing that impresses me the most is that he hasn't looked out of place at all. He's not caught up in the, in the hype of... Uh, you know, getting in to National Hockey League games here through the preseason. He's been very on, very much on an even keel, and he's fit in from... Encouraging to see the amount of promise as well, considering he seems to be looking more and more confident with each and every game, and that just bodes well, yeah. whether he plays up here, whether he plays with the AHL, a fast learner. Well, I think so, and I mean, being 23 years old, he's not uh, coming into a situation as a Nazem Kadri, who's going to be 19 in a couple of weeks. You know, he's 23 years old, so he's that much more mature, and I think it's easier that way for him to step into the pressure. He's a bigger, stronger guy, and he's really, you know, adapted well in this training camp. Him and Bozak have really gelled well together, but doesn't matter who he's played with, he's really looked good. All right, well, let's head downstairs now to the Toronto Maple Leafs. Dressing room, Paul Hendrick, joined by Victor Stahlberg. Andy and Bob, thanks very much. Uh, Victor, the big goal for you and a beautiful play by Bozak. And uh, you guys have lived together, now getting a chance to play together. It looked like uh, time work, and you certainly knew what you were doing out there on that goal. Yeah, you know, we're, we're just out there having a lot of fun right now. Uh, we got to enjoy the moment here. Uh, you never know how long it will last. But, uh, you know, hopefully we'll be playing together Thursday night. What a great camp you've had. But it's a camp that you've built up and certainly gained confidence as time has gone on. What is the second game's meant to you as your confidence has grown? I think you're, you're just realizing that you can play with, you know, the big names out there. Um, as we get along here, you know, longer in the camp, uh, they're playing better players out there, obviously. And uh, I think I've been trying to play the same way, you know. Uh, you have a little less time, less space. But I think I found a way to be able to play out there, which is uh, great for my confidence. Have you been able to find that the game has slowed down? Maybe in the beginning it might have seemed a little quick, but at least mentally for you the game has slowed down out yeah, there? Yeah, I definitely think it does. You know, we, uh, as you get along there, you know, you're... Uh, you're trying to uh, play a little, you know, like the other guys do, and they're, they're a little more poised with the pucks, with, which, you know, I mean, it's faster in certain aspects, but, uh, you know, you're not as much running around maybe as I did in college and in the first couple of games here. An exciting time. I, I know there's been a lot of talk about the youngsters, you know, meaning yourself and a few other hockey club uh, obviously you haven't been told anything yet but uh, you, I guess it's just one day at a time isn't it yeah I guess uh, we'll find out tomorrow you know the team's leaving for up north for, uh, for a couple of days to uh, to bond up there and uh, we'll see what happens I, I obviously hope uh, I'm going to get a chance here to start off the season but if not I'm, I'm you know tr have my faith in the coaches and management that they know what's best for me have you been able to pinpoint exactly what has helped you ease the transition from the University of Vermont to, to playing at this level, at least this this part of the season? I think a huge thing is my, my coach, Kevin Snyder of Vermont. He uh, he was a big help for me there. You know, coming in there, I was uh, a little puppy. You know, I was turning mm -hmm. pucks over and uh, doing, like, baby mistakes that you shouldn't do out there. And over three years, he, he taught me a lot. You know, mistake management will... Uh, will make or break you at the next level. So I think that's uh, the biggest thing he taught me. Well, congratulations tonight. Uh, good luck uh, tomorrow on what might be an announcement that you've made this hockey team. Yeah, thanks. Victor Stahlberg, night. five goals this preseason, including the game-winning goal here tonight. Andy and Bob, back to you. Thank you very much, Paul. It is a 2-1 victory for the Toronto Maple Leafs over the Detroit Red Wings. As mentioned, an excellent preseason so far for them.